Welcome to episode 104 of Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Tiny bit later than advertised, I'm sure we'll talk about that during the show. Um, what are we doing? Well, well, last week the wheel picked driving racing games. Because we've done driving, not racing games, previously, and now we're doing... Ga- and it's exactly what it sounds like. We're doing racing games. So I have a whole bunch, as always, uh, ready to go. So we might get through all of them. And we might not. Because we're starting late, because I've just arrived home from a bank holiday weekend. And I've just been um, in a car for 10 hours. Granted, we stopped to charge a couple of times. But it's been a quite a long journey. So uh, we're going to do the best we can. My eyes are feeling a little bit tired, hence the glasses. Um, So let's see. Let's see how we get on, shall we? Uh, And we're going to start on the Game Boy. So let's boop across the little screen, but also boop across to the Game Boy screen and see what our first game is. There we go. So, as you can see, it's the Game Boy. Um... Game Boy Colour, I, I can tell because it's got colour on it, so that's good. And we're going to kick off with Konami Crazy Racers. I know, right? Um, so, let's do that. Right, press in that button, one second. And grabbing that screen. There it is. Konami Crazy Racers. Okay. Konami man. And of course, you might think that we might start with with Mario Kart. But I thought that would be too obvious. So I didn't put any Mario Kart on. So these are Konami characters. Oh, it looks like it's a Game Boy Advance game. I'm sure it, it's... Too, oh, it does say Game Boy Advance. See, I made this list earlier on. Uh, so, technically then, we don't be on this screen because it's better on the other screen. Oh, after all that. Tell you. Been a long day. Been a long day. Um, let's do this one then, and let's make the screen bigger so you can see better what's going on. It makes it a little bit more pixelated, but there you go. Um, okay. Let's see if my tired eyes can keep up with this. No, go back. How's the volume? If you're not close to made it into the chat room, she'll be able to tell us uh, any second. Give her a chance, because like I say, we're running late, so everyone's plans are a little bit shifted. Uh, We start with the um, race menu. Do we want to do a Grand Prix? I'm sure we do. Let's let's start. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, that black and white cube screen then. Oof. Okay, do we have a Konami character preference? I'm um, honestly. I know, not your close to. I'm so sorry for dragging you away from whatever you were doing on your bank holiday Monday. Um, I don't know any of these characters, to be honest. So, let's do that one. So, I, I think most of these are going to involve some sort of car racing. I'm hoping so. They've got racing in the title. 
Um, but in all honesty, I did do all games, look through all games and see if they've got racing in the title or racer or race. And then pick from that. for very long is it but I'm in second which means I might be able to get one of these how do I fire it though oh can I stay can I keep up can I keep first Freaking miracle if I can. Can't seem to use those um, any power ups that I get though. Oh, I've only just found. Oh, oh okay. Because you don't use the lover button. Well, I came first anyway, but. Shoulder buttons! Because it's. Give away a fancy. But I did have it set for a busy course. Oh, right. Get out of here, little shit. Oh, oh. Whoa! Shit! <laughs> Don't press jump when you're going over the jump. Wow, this is substantially more difficult. None of the computer ones just drop off the side like I just. Oh, really? Turn me into a little pig? Squeal, piggy. Doing all right then, blew up on it. Can I stick? No, I can't steal a fourth. Well, maybe I've got another lap. Depends if I totally frudge it. Shit! <laughs> oh my god!
third, am I? Oh, am I? Am I? Oh! Oh, just! Just! <laughs> wow. This is a cute one. Did I miss which console? Yes, uh, you possibly did. It's the Game Boy Advance. This is on. So, you've seen it on quite a big screen, upscaled quite a bit. It would be less pixely, look, I, I guess. Um, okay, well, I tell you what, we have a lot of games to get through. So, um, if you like any of these and you want to see more of them, let us know and we'll put them on the revisit section. Um, I'd like to get through as many as I could in this sort of abbreviated show. So, um, let's do that. And let's pull up our next game. Okay, our next game is still on the Game Boy Advance. It is Nick Toons Racing. So all your favourite Nick Toons characters, all here for your enjoyment. Oh dear. Okay. It look on your screen. Okay, adequate. Yeah. Okay, well, who do we want? I don't know. Perhaps we should go for SpongeBob. Arguably the most famous of them. We can play with a different character if Nutty Cluster wants later. Oh. Right, different controls do we think? Or not? So, same controls. Proper drags you down as well on the on the sand. Celebration's not very good for Mr. Squarepants. Yeah, so I came last on that one. So I give you Konami races is easier. So you have to play a bunch to get the tracks.
Oh, referee. Come on again. Keep forgetting whether it's the jump's not a button, it's actually a shoulder button. on it a tiny bit. that jumping business. Third. Oh, last then. Oh no. Right, okay. Not last. We try a different character, see if we get. So he's got better acceleration. It's not a good. St oh, it's one of these, isn't it? difference between I understand acceleration and top speed but what's power How, what's the difference it's got quite good acceleration it's not got a good top speed though let's do what's his face from Rugrats Titan. Oh, oh, cunty bollocks. See, I don't move as fast as SpongeBob, but I've got better acceleration when I get going. When I don't run off the road. that jump. Oh, 
okay. So, there we go. Nick Toombs Racing. Now, this is going to be interesting. So, we're moving on. If I can find it. We're moving on to the N64. Now, I'm in the process of retrofitting. I say in the process. I bought I bought the bits. Some of them arrived, some haven't. Of retrofitting a broken N64 controller for um so it's wireless. I'm putting a wireless kit in it. Which means I should be able to play games on here with it. You'd like to hope. Touch wood and all that. Um because for the N64 and future Nintendo consoles from that had all sorts of weird buttons and shit. Like Z buttons and what have you. So, hopefully at some point, we might be able to do that. But for now, we're just going to play with our ordinary controller. And as you can see on screen, because it's massive, one second, we're going to play Diddy Kong Racing. Because we had to have some kind of Mario Kart, didn't we? So, um, because we're using the, the Dubri What's It controller, um, we should have enough buttons to do left, right, brake and accelerate, shouldn't we? And shoot. So let's see what happens. Let's just make sure, shall we? Nerf for Nintendo. Yes, okay, it has, it has selected the right. I feel like I used to play this a lot with my son when we, uh, when it was out. Okay, so we're using our analog, not again, are we, for this? Uh, do we get it, uh, how fast anyone is? Okay. I'm Diddy! Uh -huh. Oh yeah, and this kit has built-in rumble pack as well, so that'll be interesting. Looks like a reasonably easy DIY. Um, we'll do tracks, because we don't want to get involved in a massive... Right, let's go. Diddy Kong's. What do the shoulder buttons do? I should check those.
come on, some last. It's been a long time since I've played this one. Let's try a different track. Oh, no, let's try the same track again. Yeah, doesn't it just? Like Buster, it certainly does. finger on the go button and then I just keep going and I don't stop to go around corners or slow down or anything. Yeah, mother. And sometimes I turn around backwards almost. I think all the ones in front have got faster top speed than I've got. Oh, don't blow it! Don't blow it! Oh, rest! Wow. Thought I got it then as well. trying to say, Nutty Cluster. What, what about my driving in real life? What? No, don't say it. Don't say anything at all. Where, where do we go? Sherbet Island? Ooh, hovercraft. Controls differently. Never gonna hear the end of this, am I, little cluster? It's tiny, tiny, and I, I, I've offered to have it repaired, and he said no. I don't want it repairing, so you cannot always hold it against me. That's what he said. That's what he said. Oh dear, oh dear. Jeepers, have we only been going 12 minutes? It feels a lot longer. Um. I still want my track. I quite like Diddy Kong Racing. 
Disappointed when we um Emma get to the end and we not play in certain games, you know? We might be like, oh I wish we'd not play Diddy Kong so long, but Must have done all the modes of transport kind of. Based on the birdie song. Third! Third again. Have you tracked a simulator? You don't race tractors. Unless you mean in some, you're just being sarcastic. Right, okay, well, look. Diddy Kong Racing! Enjoyed it. I like Diddy Kong Racing. And that's our entry, that's our Mario Kart entry, for want of a better. And I know, I know, some of you might go, no, it's not, it's not, we'll play Mario Kart. But we'll see. I'm sure racing will come round again and we'll end up um, with more racing games. However, we're going to stick with the N64 um, for our next racing game um, so let's go grab your screen oh they're all black it's difficult to there we go ah oh, yes this is a lego braces No, no, Nutty Cluster, this is... Again, you're taking the purse, aren't you? This is racing games. We did driving games previously. Okay. We don't need the story, we're here to race. Ooh.
Well, that looks quite curvy and stuff, doesn't it? Same sort of game engine, wouldn't you? You have seen me driving reasonably fine on the other games. Very lost. Last. Ra last. Don't look at me like that. Done. Didn't like it. Let's try some other ones, shall we? Let's move on to... Shall we do a couple of Mega Drive games? Why don't we do a couple of Mega Drive games? I'll cheer Nutty Cluster up no end. So, we're going to start with Rock and Roll Racing. Which you would assume has both rock and roll. And perhaps racing in it. Well, there you go. That's a rock and roll. Feels more like the blues to me, but okay. It's Fabio. Hello, Fabio. Full Batman. Chewbacca. Ooh. Some catty people. It's 
So we just stick with Fabio, who was there first. Oh, we've, we've got to buy a, we've got to buy a car. Which car are we having? Having this one. Let's just start. Let the carnage begin. Oh. Okay. So we got. Shred is dominating the race. Shred is about to blow. I mean, okay, we've got, um, we've got a nice 16-bit cover version of Paranoid. Yeah, fair dues. Shred fades into last. Oh, tits. is about to blow. On you. Fruit pickings. Anyway. Viper is dominating the race. I'm not sure whether I like this angle particularly. Rip fades into last. Is about to blow. Get lost. Oh, whoa, fades into last. Shred jams into first. Snake launches himself. Okay, look for a fleeting minute or two. I was in the lead there. Shred fades into last. Oh. Looking at Nutty Cluster's comment. Yes, I'm blaming Nutty Cluster's comment. Um, this game is rock and roll racing on the Mega Drive. Snake looks lost out there. Viper scores. A it does look micro machine, seconds. doesn't it? Shred takes a weak third. Snake is in but not as good. Zone. I feel micro machine was proper top down. Not this. Weird isometric 3D type. Um, I mean, can we? Is, is, is it worth buying equipment? Okay, is it, do we have the money for equipment? No, we freaking don't. Can't even afford the cheapest thing on there. Tea, tea, you want to get the tea? Oh my god! I mean, Nutty Cluster, you always get the blame. The stage is set, the green flag drops! <laughs> Doesn't help that I don't know what the bloody buttons are. Rip is about to blow. Snake looks lost out there. I wonder if I'm not supposed to be banging myself down those jumps. Is dominating the race. Snake 
looks lost out there. Shred is about to blow. Viper jams into first. See, I feel coming down those ramps slows me down. I'm going really fast. Last lap! Snake looks lost out there! Viper is dominating the race! Scores a first place knockout. Oh dear, oh dear. It's disappointing that, isn't it? A weak third. Snake is in another time zone. Yeah, yeah, all right. I don't feel I'm going to get any better at that. So, what we'll do is we'll move on. Because... We're going to play a game now that I looked at when we did cartoons. I was like, oh, that's got to be the cat. That's got to go on the cartoon show. Um, but I thought, no, I'll save it for racing. And the next time we did a cartoon show, it was like, put it on the cartoon show. And I was like, oh, no, I'll save it for racing. So um, if you can figure out a cartoon that involves racing then um, I think you'll probably know what we're going to play next. This is the Mega Drive version of... And this is... Wacky Races. Okay, who do we want to be? Oh, is there a Penelope Pit Stop? Got to be Penelope Pit Stop, aren't we really? Oh, okay, lots of dials, what's going on? Oh, me not likey. Oh, the controls on this are horrible. <laughs> Can't catch anything, let alone the pigeon. I'm so disappointed with this. I thought it would be super good. Now, there are games called Wacky Races on other consoles. Will they be this game? Or will it be a better version of this game? I mean, you consider some of the games that we've played. Tonight! Just tonight! And they feel better than this. See, all these cars have, have lapped me once. I mean, why is it not taking up the full screen? Why, why do we have the useless bottom half of the screen 
bad design choice. Super disappointed. Wow. In fact, I'm so disappointed. I'm so disappointed. I'm going to check out another game called Wacky Races and see if it's the same. Okay, so that was Wacky Races. Oh, I wonder what console I'm going to use. Mm hmm. We just have to wait. I can't. Right. So. We're going to check a different one because, gosh darn it, the, the PlayStation one can't look like that, can it? Can it? Oh. I don't know if I've captured the right one. One second. Well, why do I still have the old one open? That's a good question. It's a good question. Um, I don't. Okay, so that's good. There we go. You can see it's got the right one now because it's fucking huge. Just shrink it back down to a decent size. That's what she said. Right, let's have a look. Come on, don't let me down, wacky races. Don't you know we've got a race to win? Son of Raven, son of Raven, stop your sniveling. I've got a dastardly plan to win this race. <laughs> and now, here they are, the most daredevil group of daffy drivers to ever whirl their wheels in the wacky races. And away they go on the way out wacky race. Leading the race is the Turbo Terrific, driven by Peter Perfect. Maneuvering for position is the Army Surplus Special. Oh, and here's the lovely Penelope Pit Stop, the glamour gal of the gas pedal. Next, we have the Bouldermobile with the Slag Brothers, Rock and Gravel. Lurching along Two in the Captain creepy Cave group Menzies. is the Gruesome Twosome. And right on their tail is the Red Max. And sneaking along last is that mean machine with those double-dealing do-batters, Dick Dastardly, and his sidekick, Muttley. <laughs> Just watch this dastardly dirty deed. Curses! Foiled again! So his dastardly plan was overtaken. No wonder he got beaten all the time. So, good, good intro. What's the actual game going to be like? Come on. Come to Papa. And now, here they are, the most daredevil group. What do you... What? And now... Number five. Hmm. Which way do we? Hmm. Which way? Three, two, oh, let's take one. Go. See, better. Do we not agree? Oh no! Battle Royale in this race. Watch out, Miggly! Oh, that's not good. No shit. Better luck next time. Oh my! Look out! I'm late for a hair point, man. 
don't know what the fire is if I get any decent anything to shoot. Mike, <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> oh, dear. Get going. Uh oh. Oh, this looks like a real crisis, folks. Some shortcut. Sorry. Oh. So long, fellas. Oh, no. Uh I've got rockets, but I don't know how to fire them. Oh, well, what was that that did that? Second, then how the freaking hell did I come second? Wow, we need that as a quote. What was that? Penelope got pounded. Yeah, oh my god, who thought? Let's do a voiceover and we'll put that in. Holy Moses! Well, look, that was that was a lot better. I wish I picked that one. That was wacky, wacky races on the PlayStation, but we've got to keep moving on. Um, we're going to look at a Mega Drive uh, 32X game before we move on. And we're going to... Uh, it's called BC Racers. So, let's grab you a screen. Ooh, BC Racers. Here we go. So I'm not quite sure whether BC means they're going to be dinosaurs or, or what. But we don't often play a CD32, uh, so CD32, 32X game uh, on here. So let's have a go. Uh, I'm starting to get a headache from my glasses. Yay. And it's hurting my ears. Woo. Yeah, it has been a very long 12 minutes, hasn't it? Let's play. Let's play the oh, play the women in bikinis, shall we? Cause why not? Granite and Tina. Nope, it's not that one. Nope. That one! Oh, that's fast! Oh my god! Oh! Alright, how do I start again? 
Yes, continue. Oh, that's very fast, too fast. That's like... Wow! It's just so difficult. They're not slowing down either, I can't, I can't. I wonder if there's a slower car. That's the last time I get tempted by scantily clad women. Let's try this fella. I need some more oh, slow acceleration. Shit, which button was it again? That one. Oh, it's still bad. Not quite as bad as those girls, but shit. You know, part of me wonders if and I'm just grasping at straws, but part of me wonders if the um, emulation's just running too fast. Come last. Sixth. So I beat one person and one person did not finish. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, so I, I've got no idea how long we've been running. Oh, I do have a rough idea, because there's a stream length, isn't there? So that's fine, that's fine. Uh, BC Racers! <laughs> Meh. Meh. It was alright. Just freaking fast. Wow. Uh, okay. Okay, we're going to do some PlayStation Plus. We like the PlayStation Plus. I want to say we. I mean me. Uh, it's um, it's got some cool games on it, and I like playing those games. Um, and we're gonna play. Um, some Crash Tag Team Racing on the PSP. So, oh, it's super wide screen, so the screen doesn't fit properly. So, let's just shift this down a little bit. Doesn't mean it's a little smaller for you, but it'll probably be higher def. There we go. How's that? You get to see everything. Thank you for the time check. Can I play with my glasses off? Not now. Fuck my eyes by putting them on.
Okay, let's go. Top of the morning and the cock a doodle do sports fans. Chick Gizzard Lips here, welcoming you to the Chick farewell Gizzard race Lips. at Von <laughs> Clutch's Motor World. That's right, Chick Baby. On what might be the final day of operation, Von Clutch will surely have to turn out the lights on his lifelong dream. Von Clutch, the deranged genius cyborg, has fabricated the ultimate auto racing theme park. Indeed, the park's tracks have wreaked terror on its participants. Too gruesome for this reporter to describe over the air. Well, I ain't got a problem with it. Man, you ever put a big ham in a wood chipper? I know I have. <clears throat> oh, sorry. But now old Von Clutch's power gems have been stolen. Giving Von Clutch just a few hours to get his power gems back. Oh, it's slam dunk. Thank you, punk. Ebenezer Von Clutch is now risking his park ownership in a high-stakes, no-holds-barred race. Race contestants must survive a gauntlet of each of the park's five lands and recover every one of the power gems that have been Spoilers, stolen. Spoilers, we won't be watching all five lands. a matter of time before we do away with these meddlesome rodents forever! <laughs> oh. Pasadena? Really? I have only a short time left before I am Kaputsky. We must find more racers. Is there no dumb cuffs among you to accept the challenge of the greatest race of all time? Well, sports fans, it appears we found our dunkers. Okay, newbie. To walk or run, simply move the analog stick or directional buttons in the direction you want Crash to move. Go ahead. I won't laugh. Um. So. Small objects might require you to jump, move to get over. Now hit do we, that do we have to button, and let's see you get do just a to our car? Jump. Come on, baby, feel it. Large obstacles or distances require you to do your first double jump. Press the square button to perform a spin attack to break certain objects. You know, Wumpa coins are scattered everywhere, and even inside certain objects. Collect that coin, baby, and spend it like crazy on new stuff. Bling, bling. Dude, you've got quite a lag there, Nutty Cluster. I assume you're talking about the the Nazi Dumpkoff. Von Clutch. Is that his name? Yo, yo! Activation buttons require you to body slam to trigger it. Press what about the racing? Then press that circle button while still in the air to do a body slam. Slam a jam up on ammo ramp. That wasn't it. That was. Okay. Shit. That's great. What's that noise? Right back to the start, haven't I? Um, I mean, technically, I should be turning this off because it's not racing. This is not what we signed up for. And he said crash tag team racing. I thought, bingo, we're racing. Fantastic. Oh, 
Oh! Cock! Houston. Where's, where's, where do we jump to? It's gone over there now, hasn't it? How do I get back now? That's it. Do you know what I'm going to do? It's not racing. Um, we're going to... Uh, we're going to put it on... A revisit. Because it does, you know, it is the sort of game that we would play if we weren't racing. So... Um, crash... Tag team racing. There you go. It's there for a revisit. If um, if when we need to do a revisit, um, because we're racing tonight. I'm sorry. I'm going to be quite firm about this. So let's move uh, back to the PlayStation, shall we? Yes. Let's move to. Um, the most sensational, inspirational, celebrational, muppetational, um, Muppet race mania. So, all over the place today because all the screens are different sizes. Oh, excuse me, I'm super tired. Okay. Oh, ouch. So many copyright stuff. Come on. Okay, be a racing game. Be a racing game. Paul Beaker. Is his head going to go right to the top? I mean, come on. You're not a disc-based system anymore. You're on my computer. You don't need to load a disc. Okay. Guess that means which ones do you want to drive? You and I would make a great team. Oh, okay. Pick moi if you want to win. It's a great day for a drive. Are they all doing Stevie Wonder impressions? I'm fuzzy. Waka waka. Now, it doesn't tell you the different skills or anything. Yo, this is Rizzo here. Right. Oh. Oh. Animal. Animal. Ebony and ivory. Woof, woof. Rolf the dog here. Pleased to meet you. 
Me, me, or... Decided. Right. Do we have choices? Left and right don't do anything. Oh, whoa, whoa there, Leslie, what's going on? No, don't need to tap. No, no, that'll do. Oh, you're a little fast, actually. Can't we drive with our backs to you? Do we have to drive in 3D? So, this isn't where you pick your driver then. Select a course. Oh, okay. It's what, what's, what's not equals to saying it's way past your bedtime. No, it's not. It's my bedtime in two minutes. Uh, are there more games? There's two more after this. Um, well, let's, let's start at the top, shall we? I've heard it too many times to ignore it. It's something that I'm supposed to be Someday we'll find it The rainbow connection Oh no, this is going to get me copyright Ah, oh, friggy frig Yeah, not thought about that I was just enjoying it Oh, you can't be monetized because you've got hey, something in there you, you shouldn't have. you want to watch this race? I can't. I'm swamped. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. It has to be Beaker, doesn't it? All right. Let's have a look. Uh, 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 uh. Hmm. Wow, it's super difficult to control. I'd prefer if the camera wasn't just flying around all over. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Again, the camera should stay behind the racer at all times. Is there an option for that? Someone's firing shit at me. Try a different car, shall we? Miss Piggy seems like she might be more firmer, rooted, and you know, stuck to the ground from her weight. Oh, 
summer's day. Nearly got Janice then. Mm. Mm. Uh, right. Do you know what? I tell you what. We're going to save our next game for another time. And we're going to play our last game. That's what we're going to do. I told you it would be a kind of a short show. Um, so, in that case, let me close that one. Because that one will fit quite nicely into a different category that we'll have later on. Um, where's this one? I've got even no idea, even if it's a racing game, to be honest. Uh, because this is on the Turbo Graphics, the PC Engine. Um, and it's got a Japanese name. I know, right? So. Let's grab that and make this our last game. Because my poor little eyes... Super tired. So, here we go. Boom. Let's get that here so I can see it. This is Racing Damashil. Or oh, is it Damash... Damashi? Is that two eyes? Can't tell with my eyes. Oh no, this might be bike racing. Well, look, we're not going to be on this very long. I'll tell you that now. Let's go on that one that looks super weird. Looks like an alien skull. I'm just going to keep pressing wordy words to words. Wordy, wordy words. Sorry if that's something rude. We should have played a bit more Muppet, shouldn't we? And just carried on with that instead. I have no idea what difference any of those will make. Didn't slow down enough though, did I? So again, why? Even though I've picked one player game, it's not a full screen. Dead if I hit that many tyres. Okay, so how fast can we get? Three hundred miles an hour. I know, I know, it was only one, one rack, but it was racing, and you were driving, driving a bike, it did fit, I just, I just can't, I just can't, we're going to go back to this one, and we're going to say, oh, that's what we're going to say, oh, oh my eyes, um, well, we're not going to back, we've got to this screen too early, haven't we? And you know we have. 
because we need to go to this screen first. And now I can't see anything. Um, not that one. There it is. I see it. Wait for me. There we go. So let's give it a spin and see what we're doing next week. Oh, Collector Vision Games. Okay, we're going to go into the pasty past. Pasty, the nasty pasty. Now, um, we're going to go and look at uh, the console I had growing up after my Atari VCS, which was the Collector Vision. And we're going to play a bunch of games from that. We may intersperse other games, because I do understand that the older older games might be a bit boring for some of you, some of you younger people. Um, we'll see. We'll see how we get on. If you're watching it because we're playing Collector Vision, you'd be very disappointed if I put other games in, wouldn't you? So I should really stick to what I promise, I think. Um, anywho. Now we can go back to the screen. Yay, there we go. Okay, well, big thank you to you live Twitch listeners, watchers who are watching us live on a Monday, on a bank holiday Monday of, of all times. Um, and if you're watching this on YouTube, did you know you can join us on Twitch on a Monday? Usually from about 7 o'clock. 99% of the episodes usually nine, 7 o'clock, so... Uh, yeah, watch us there live on Twitch as Snug Radio. Uh, you can email us if you want, uh, retro at snugradio.co.uk, retro at snugradio.co.uk. Um, that's also the website, snugradio.co.uk. Uh, we're also all over the place on the internet as Snug Radio. That would be Facebook, Twitter, TikTok. It's already told you about Twitch and YouTube. Um, did you know Nutty Cluster? has a design shop called Ink Inspiration, which sells all sorts of uh, delightful um, designs for you to put on stickers and bags and duvet covers. Um, that's at Redbubble. So look for Ink Inspiration at Redbubble or click on the link somewhere in the show notes. Um, I also have a design shop called The Glorious Idiot. Uh, we've just put up three or four new designs um, of coffee cats they're ready to go you will be putting posts of them out next week sometime um, so that's on Redbubble as well The Glorious Idiot find me there or click on the link below um, what else is there? well we should also stream on Twitch on a Tuesday and a Friday um, easy listening music or music from library music collections because uh, they tend to get uh, demonetized less. And um, yeah, well, that's on Twitch. I mean, jo join us there. So, I think that's everything. Uh, if you don't, to discount the Discord, of course. Snug Radio has a Discord. All sorts of things going on there. Uh, we're currently, currently playing with AI songs. So, if you'd like to, um, if you've got a suggestion, a theme, or some lyrics that you'd like putting into a song. You can put them on our Discord. That's quite fun. And that's it. That's it for me for this week. This has been... I, well, no. No. I've been math. It's math first. Then it's Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Oh, we'll be back at the same time, same place next week. Until next time. Bye. And play something retro.